Bree here, the registered nurse and certified health coach of Hippie Dippy Mom. I am here to help you eliminate as many household toxins as possible. These toxins are hiding in so many areas of your home and they contribute to all disease as we know it. So super important to get this stuff out of your home. Today's topic is all about sunscreen. So it is officially summer which means that you know we're going to be doing a lot more outdoor stuff we're going to be in the sun more so sun protection can be really important um first you know i really want to cover that getting the sunshine is so getting sunshine the benefits of it is so important to health um i kind of feel like the devil or the sun's been made out to be like the devil you know like it causes all these issues it causes skin cancer and yes and no we need the sun for vitamin d synthesis which vitamin d is really important to a lot of um, body functions some uv rays have actually been shown to be anti-cancer so we definitely want to be getting the benefits of those uv rays and then this doesn't really have anything to do with sunscreen, but I thought I would throw it in here. Um, the sun is great at boosting our mood. I don't think there's anybody I've ever met that isn't happy when the sun comes out. So another great benefit of getting some sunshine. So when it comes to sunscreen, sunscreen is not something that we want to be wearing all day, every day. We want to use it really only when we need it. So we need it when we're gonna be outside for long periods of time um, to get the vitamin D synthesis going that you need from the sun. Um, the amount of time that you have to spend outside is gonna be different based really on your skin color and how sensitive you are to the sun. So um, for someone that's light skin like me, I will spend less time in the sun before applying sunscreen, whereas someone with darker skin can be out for a longer period of time before applying sunscreen. Um, so, you know, so many sunscreens are really, really, really toxic. They have chemicals and fragrance. They have um, nano-sized particles in it that we really don't want on our skin. And so what can you look for to know that you're getting a really good quality sunscreen? You want to look for non-nano sized particles of the zinc oxide and titanium dioxide. And if it doesn't say it on the container, the packaging of the sunscreen anywhere, then go to the company's website or send them an email and ask them. Um, we want to be avoiding fragrance if it has the word fragrance on it, on any product that you're using, you really want to avoid that as well. You want to avoid PABA, P-A-B-A, and benzophenone. Those are some of the top ingredients you really want to stay away from when it comes to sunscreen. So one of my favorite brands of sunscreen is Baby Gannics. I don't know if you can see it. Baby Gannics. Um, they have creams, lotions, they have the little tubes that you can just wipe on, they have sprays, so super good. Their particles are nan non-nano size. Um, and then another brand I like is Goddess Garden. This one's a spray on, they do have other ones as well. So those are super good brands and a brand of Face cream, tinted face cream that has SPF in it that I really like is Herbal Choice Mari. Um, I purchased it through Amazon, but I found it through EWG.org. It was rated on EWG as really, really clean. So um, that's another great product to, to use. Um, so I think that these are three great options that'll give you a really great head start when it comes to using non-toxic sunscreen. I also have a blog post up at hippydippymom.com that is nine, covers nine um, items that I feel are a must have in your beach bag. And I share, you know, all the non-toxic ways to have these must have items in your beach bag, your picnic basket, your vacation 
um, bags, whatever, whatever it is that you're going to be doing this summer. So go check that out at hippydippymom.com. And then I also have a resources page on my website where I list some of my favorite stuff like the items that I showed you today. So make sure you're checking that out as well. And I'm also accepting beta testers to my new online program. It is Toxin Free Family and I cover more topics kind of like today, but more things in your home that contain chemicals and how to identify them, get rid of them. Um, it comes with the support that you need with all the information, steps to take, a private Facebook group with weekly coaching calls with me. So you can ask any questions that you have um, during those coaching calls. And so I will link to that in my bio as well. So just head back to at Hippy Dippy Mom and click the link in the bio. And if you have any questions at all, feel free to email me at brie at hippydippymom.com and brie is spelled B-R-I. That's it for today. See you soon. Take care.